Hi guys, so I wanted to come to you with a video that I hope some people find really helpful um, and it's how to handle loss in school at the same time. Recently I just lost my aunt to cancer and I thought that I could handle it, you know, I thought that I could juggle my emotional mind state and school at the same time and I didn't do it right and I wish that there was a video like this, you know, to kind of help me out. So um, I'm just going to kind of list off a couple of tips and tricks to being able to manage school and dealing with loss or depression or anything like that. So um, the first thing would have to be that notify your professors about what's going on. Now I know that might be embarrassing and I know that might be something that you just don't want to do because that's exactly how I felt where I was just like um, I don't need them to be in my personal business I'll just figure it out I'll handle everything wrong. A lot of times professors will understand what you're going through and some of them will be lenient especially if you're dealing with a family death and some of them can extend assignments or even defer certain assignments and it is really helpful because it is your education you know what I mean like you do pay for it so anything that you can do to help you so that you can still stay on track you should do my second tip would be to talk to someone whether it's someone professionally at your school or somewhere private or even a family or friend like you need to be able to get everything out and that's the thing that I did wrong. I kept everything bottled in and I tried to be strong for my family and I did not want to have to deal with everything right now. I just wanted to focus on school and getting everything out of the way. But that hindered me because I wasn't focusing on school. I was just focusing on everything that was going on in my life. So talk to someone. Uh, my third tip would be to take care of yourself. That's another thing that I didn't do. Like I tried to just focus on school and getting everything out of the way and I didn't take any time for me and to process everything and just to relax. Um, even with family and friends, like they needed me for different things and I kept throwing myself into projects and that did not work out. So definitely take time for yourself, take time to pamper yourself, whether it's a spa day, getting your nails done, or even just sitting at home, chilling for the weekend by yourself and just relaxing, not thinking about work, school, assignments, none of that stuff. Um, my fourth tip would be, don't be afraid to ask for help. And again, I did not do that. I was, I'm a very prideful person, so I never like to tell people that I need help and I don't ever think that I really do need help until the last minute and I'm just like okay maybe I should have asked for help maybe I should have taken someone's offer so don't ever be afraid to take the help because you do need it and it does make things easier for you um, and the fifth tip would be don't be afraid to tell people you need to be left alone like sometimes I know for me personally I like to help everyone else and I'm always trying to do things for everyone else and I can never tell people no and when you're dealing with loss and you're dealing with so many different situations sometimes you have to be able to tell people you know I love you and I you know I'd be there for you but for right now I need to be there for myself and I just need to be left alone just for a couple of days a week just to process my thoughts and just get myself together. Okay, so those are my five tips for dealing with loss and juggling school at the same time. If you guys have any questions or if you have any tips to share yourself, feel free to leave it in the comment section and until next time, bye.